Welcome back. I know this video is a little bit late in coming out. All of you probably have chosen your mods already, but uh, forgive me, I was away at Turkey for a very long time and I didn't score that well for my results. So a little bit, I procrastinated a little bit there. So 30 to 60 seconds each for all the mods. I took five mods this semester and one orbital mod over the summer. So orbital is a summer software engineering module designed for SOC students. So actually you can take it if you're not an SOC, SOC student, you just have to pair up with an SOC student. And most people take this as a rite of passage for four, to clear four MCs of pass-fail mod and also put a project in their resume. But it's only useful for people who are applying for software engineering roles, okay? So honestly, this entire module is completely self-learning. That's what I like and didn't like about it. You can choose your own difficulty here, but they don't teach you anything. You have to learn everything by yourself through Stack Overflow, through YouTube videos, through documentation online. So other than a few Zoom seminars type of things where they go through some basics, you're entirely on your own, you and your partner. And the key about this is that it's basically like you're just doing your own project, but the thing is you're held accountable uh, you have to present your work and you have to document it. Choosing a partner is very important, right? You don't want to be thanking the entire work throughout this whole summer because summer is still a time for you to relax and enjoy. And I'm sorry to touch it and you have to thank for my job. So everybody keeps saying, go for Apollo, second highest, or go for Artemis, which is the highest level. Honestly, don't listen to them. Just choose whatever you feel like. I bet an internship at the start would even be more useful for finding a future job or future internship in semester in year two semester. You can always do a project in your free time unless you want to be told what to do. So GSS1025, right? This is the famous legendary what mod. The hell? Oh my god, no way. Module in NUS because it is a pass fail module and the workload is so it's so little. Four MCs, pass fail, easy. I used to be very skeptical because I would like to put in effort for a general elective module. And let's face it, it's a minimum B plus or average A minus. So I thought I could pull my cap up. Instead, right, please shut up and take this module, right? It is so low workload that you can focus your time and energy into other things like CCAs and other core modules, which is so much more useful. It's just fortnightly classes, a simple class presentation, and just some reflections here and there. I genuinely enjoyed myself um, it's not biased in any way, but it's exactly what CIP lessons should be like in secondary school. IS2101, which is business communications, right? Um, it's a core mod for us. It's similar to CS2101, which is also for CS students, it's a business communication mod. A lot of people will shit on this mod, but I feel like it is quite good, right? Quite good in the sense that it is useful for SOC students. It is taught by the Center of Lingu uh, English Language Education. And I like the idea because, you know, how SOC students, they don't touch grass. It's a great opportunity to, you know, learn how to present in a very safe environment and safe space. But I feel like the module was very dingy. The slides are not modern at all. And they use clip arts and, and stock images, which feels very, like, unprofessional in a sense, even though they teach us to be professional. One, one qualm I have is that the grading absolutely sucks. It is so biased. And another team that botched that presentation, right, completely froze, right, and then they used their script halfway through the presentation. They scored the same as us, even though we did so well. I feel like we were the best group in our class, and we even did a Patrick Bateman style business cut well at least i hope that you would enjoy your time with some you know some group mates some friends you make along the way and honestly life and uni is not all about grades right if it's so subjective so yeah i don't know how business faculty kids actually do it all right next bt2101 econometrics in business analytics or something like that all right i think it's all right it's okay mod it's very very fluffy right the bell curve is stupidly high and because I made two mistakes in the finals, I actually dropped like one, two grades. Um, there is abs there's not much coding involved, right? What you're basically doing is linear regression in R. It's super simple. Um, but I feel like it's a good breath mod because you can understand how um, statistics can be used in other, ra under f other fields of study. And I say fluffy because honestly, you can use common sense for most of the, most of the time, you know? And there's almost no memorization. Alright, BT2103, which is a machine learning module. 
it's called optimization in business analytics, but I feel like it is basically intro to machine learning for business analytics kids. Uh. Um, I think they changed the module code for future batches. I think it's a 3K mod now, but you have to check. <laughs> learning curve is steep as hell, all right? But it's super doable. Just just persevere through. It is very doable. In fact, I actually enjoyed my time studying this mod. It is a primer for machine learning. They teach you math and they teach you the concepts behind SVM, you know, uh, support vector machines, uh, neural networks. And I, I just I just thought I, I love it. You know, they, there's a project in the middle of the module where you are basically doing real world application, right? You're you're clean, you're cleaning data, you're analyzing data, you're evaluating the data, you are building the model itself, and they teach you the entire package. It, it's it, it it genuinely I think it made, this whole module made me very employable. Yeah, so that is basically it for this semester. I hope you enjoyed the video. It's very quick, okay? But yeah, see you. Guys, I totally forgot one more mod I took. SD2334, alright, super. Um, I don't know. It's 70% finals, 30% midterms. Sort of like that. Yeah, nothing much to talk about it. Just study your stats very well, please. Finals, make or break it. Also, I got tonsillitis really near the finals, Lamal.